Hey, what's up? This is Dr. Frog, and yes, it's been about a month and a half that I'm still playing Far Cry. Um, I guess you could say I feel like I'm halfway through it. Let's take a look. I think I'm less than halfway through it. I swear this won't take long. Statistics, here we go. Game completed 42%, so that's roughly halfway through. Um, I'm on the second uh, map area now. This is the other half. This is the southern part of the game and I'm just getting started. Um, so there's a whole new area to explore. And yes, hide my map. This game is sponsored by Jeep. Uh, the special edition of this game, or whatever you want to call it, actually has Jeep Wranglers and I think it's the Compass uh, that you can drive. Jeep, the number one choice for African warlords. Anyway. I just wanted to show off one little thing that uh, one of my friends is interested in, and that's the plot that, of course, sort of semi-plot that unfolds. It looks like we got a little blip on our diamond finder here. The plot that semi-unfolds is you're, is you're going through the motions. Essentially, the uh, thrust of the game is that your job is to assassinate this guy who's been supplying weapons to both sides, essentially making the conflict much worse. Uh, however, along the way, you get to know your uh, your ultimate enemy by finding these uh, audio tapes of interviews. That's a radio. Shut up, radio. I know, when you shoot radio, circuit boards come flying out of them. Saw this kid in the side of the road yesterday. Couldn't have been 18, 17. Had a shotgun across his lap and a dead APR half in the ditch next to him. A couple of close-range blasts of that 12-gauge tore up big chunks of hamburger on his torso. Kid was lifting up the guy's leg, taking his boots. Kid just looked tired, just beaten down, ragged, tired, old. Kid that age shouldn't look like that. Wow, okay, pretty dramatic. Um, so, I guess it's trying to be a game of a conscience, while also, at this point, 42% of the game done, I feel nothing when I kill people now. I don't know if... I don't know. Um, I don't know if this says anything about me personally or about video games in general or something, but um, there was one point... Let's hop aboard. There was one point in this game where um, I saw some guys on an island, and even though there was really nothing for me on that island... Let me turn this thing off so I can uh, philosophize here. I set fire to the island to effectively kill them all off, threw a rocket at them, which killed almost all of them except for one guy who lay crouched huddling in an area much like that bush over there, uh, as though cringing away from me, and I, without a single thought, I pulled out uh, this silenced weapon and I shot him in the head, uh, which unlocked a safe house that I could sleep in, that I didn't even bother to sleep in. So this game it slowly turns you into the monster that you are sent to kill. And I don't know if that's intentional or not, but it is It is more interesting than a lot of other games. So that's where I'm at. I am now on a mission to go toward a red arrow, like usual. And uh, I'll just keep on keeping on. It's still a fun game. It's wearing on me a little bit. But I only played about 30 minutes at a go. And it's still fun. And that's it.